the fiesta festivities or festivities <laughs> continue and garden fest has officially kicked off the three-day event where you can enjoy german culture and delicacies it's actually located at beethoven beethoven manor Corps in the king william area yeah the night team's john paul barajas has been there all afternoon he takes us inside the german fiesta fun <laughs> Garden Fest 2023 is off to an amazing start and has all the fiesta fun but mixed with great German delicacies. It's pretty awesome. I love it. The beer cheese with the pretzel, the beer cheese is awesome. Potato pancakes, which are yummy with applesauce, and the broths are delicious. The buns are like perfect brat buns. And when you have a large selection of awesome food, you need something to wash it down with. We love the beer. Absolutely. <laughs> Garden Fest has all your domestic favorites, but it also has 15 different German beers all on tap for that crisp, tasty first sip. And to keep it at the perfect temperature, you need a beer stein. And this keeps the beer really cold. For Texas weather, this is ideal. But unlike most Fiesta events, the wardrobes you might see are slightly different like Lederhosen. You look amazing, but I think the one thing that really seals the deal on the outfit is my KSAT medal. Garden Fest is a fiesta party you don't want to miss. We'll definitely be back. I might be back Friday. Viva, Viva fiesta! fiesta! Back out here, Garden Fest is still rocking. We're still partying. It doesn't end till midnight. It's perfect timing for somebody who might get off work right after the live shot. I'm not talking about anybody specific, but if you can't come tonight, you can come tomorrow and Friday. They're partying from five to midnight. Plenty of good stuff to hang out and experience. The band is rocking. The big experience, you can't forget the beer. You can't forget the beer. Pros, it's a great time. You don't want to miss it. Come out, check it out in the King William District. I'm having a great time. There's way too many German beers that I haven't been able to taste yet. So I'm going to sign off right now and go have some fun. John Paul Barajas, KSAT 12 News. All right, John Paul, before, before you go, I know you were going to search for some Lederhosen. Did you find any Lederhosen? I did, but I only found your size, so I'll bring ah. him back to the station and you can put him on tomorrow. Don't worry about it, Steve. I got you covered. I, I was hoping it was something with a floral theme, like your shirt, like some sort of yeah. leader hosen like that yeah, to match yeah, your yeah, shirt. Yeah, you know, I, 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 needed, I, I needed something to pop. Yeah, I needed yeah, something I to pop. It, it's maybe popping. something. Maybe I'm something fiesta ready, yeah. not garden fest ready. Maybe something bright to bring out your eyes or something. I don't know. <laughs> Thank you, John Paul. Appreciate your time. Who knows? Flambeau's coming up. That's right. Thanks, this is true. Keep up to date with all of San Antonio. Antonio's top news, weather, and so much more by clicking the like and subscribe buttons below. And once again, thanks for watching KSAT.